Oh yeah, I'm doing it, I'm doing it, I'm doing it. I've got a sticker jet on a cart. Yes, now I like you, after seeing the massive pulse jet, which we fired at the French with, I thought that thing needs sticking on wheels. And also this is the most requested thing on YouTube ever. But of course this has been done before, so we've got to make sure the jet car I build is the best one you ever see. So, we on with it. see the cart to jet ratio is pretty good. We're definitely going to have enough power for this. I have no idea how I'm going to mount this. It's going to look ridiculous. Which is a good thing! Right, let's have a bit of a clean up. Chop all the stuff off we don't need, like petrol tank, radiators, gear shifters, things like that. All got to go. Been on a bit of a diet, took the rear axle off and cleaned that up because it was all seized up. But we need to make this thing a bit longer. It's going to have a massive Brett Pulse jet swinging off the back of it, and I don't want to be tipping up in the air. So, chop the end of the frame off, stretch it all out, boom. There we go. Got a seat which is left over from a TV show I worked on. Got to stretch the frame. Stick the wheels, clamp the jet down, heat the shield so I don't set fire to everything. It's a monster! And the linen's about to light! mounting the seat and then work backwards um, I think it can go a little bit further forward than this and the whole cart is the length it is because that's the length of the van and obviously I've got to be able to transport it we'll probably do it a bit a bit longer but you know there we go I'm going to shove this under here a little bit more because that is a bit of a stretch there we are <laughs> pretty comfy if that helps <laughs> Now then, while I was at the front here, I've decided to tidy up the front end because the old one was just basically a load of old scrap and rubbish. So, now, the exciting bit. Let's get a jet on the back. <laughs> But I think I'll stick an extra support at the top. So I've made another clamp up here for the jet. Now I'm going to get these bars and kind of like brace it from there down to the chassis. And then I'll do that one on the back, join the two. Hopefully it'll make it nice and rigid. And then it'll take all the flex and stuff out of the chassis. And if it doesn't, well, then I'll just have to do something else, won't I? And it'll be a complete waste of time. She's a beauty. Now the next video, we're gonna do all the fuel system, put all the valves, the controls, and things like that on it, so it'll actually work. I think you agree, this is looking pretty cool, isn't it? Yep. 
Oh, yes! <laughs> it's a comfort cat car. It's so lovely. Who knows how fast it will go? Or even if it will burn me. Oh, jet car. Now it's gonna edit this shit.